Welcome everyone, this is how to get a malt and this is how to use a malt in Jujutsu Shenanigans. In order to get a malt, you do need to get money or the rule books. In order to get those, you can actually redeem cords. In the future, there's going to be quests that you can complete in order to get money for a malt. As of right now, the only way to get a malt is by redeeming in cords. And yeah, if you want to go ahead and get some codes, I'll put some codes on the screen right now for you guys can redeem, that will give you money. But as you can see, I've got 250 money from codes and we just got a new amount, which is a test amount. So in order to equip the amount, this is what you want to go ahead and do once you do actually have a new amount. If you go to your inventory, you can see the amount that you've got. We've got the test amount, you can actually switch it as you can obviously see, test amount. By pressing B on your keyboard, you can actually go ahead and put on your amount. So what I'm going to do guys is go ahead and buy some more amounts with Robux. If you want to get amounts really quickly, comment your username and I'll give you guys some Robux to actually get some amounts. I'm actually going to buy some amounts here. Let's buy these, there we go, random amount, chill amount. I'm going to buy one more. The Robux does add up quickly. Almost about 100 Robux here, just on amount, as you can see. We now got a ton of new amount. Let's go ahead and equip all of the new amount that we just got. There we go. And let's see what they look like. Unlicensed. Oh my god, this is actually sick. How is this an amount? What the hell? Okay, that's one amount. That is pretty sick, not gonna lie. And we also got this amount. Yeah, I can't lie, this amount is so sick. And we got the chill amount. Yeah, that's how to get and use amounts in Jujutsu Tsu Shenanigans. Thank you for watching and peace out.